So my name's Tom Reed here down here in southwest Detroit and uh, this guy happened to be a friend of Becky's and I asked him if he in, be interested in doing an interview and he said he would. And your name, sir? Uh, Mike. Mike. And Mike, uh, I take these videos and I upload them to YouTube. You okay with that? Sure. Okay. Uh, where are you from, Mike? Uh, I'm from right here, Detroit. Okay, down around this area? Yeah, uh, well I grew up around, uh, like over by Woodmere Cemetery there. Oh yeah, Homer. yeah, nice area. Yep. Yeah. Did, uh, what type of work have you done in your life? Construction most of my life. Okay. Any substance abuse problems? Oh yeah, heroin, cocaine, drinking. Drinking, mm -hmm. all three, huh? Yeah. And you still doing those? Uh, unfortunately, yeah. Okay. How'd you first get on to heroin? Um, that's a good question. <laughs> I, you know, I really don't know how, I, you know, like, back in the day when I was younger, I used to try all different kinds of drugs, you know what I mean? I just, uh, I got, you know, I, I, I tried the heroin and I liked it, you know, and, uh, and uh, did a friend turn you on to that, or? Um, yeah, 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 we uh... How old were you? I was, I was probably in my late 20s. Late 20s. Yeah. Now, were you, did you smoke marijuana before then, or? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And do you consider marijuana a gateway drug? I kind of do, yeah. You really do, Me, huh? Really, my, my gateway drug is alcohol. Yeah, really? You know, yeah. And how old were you when you started drinking that? Uh, I was young, man. I was probably about uh, 15 when I started drinking. I'm 60 now. Okay. So, you know, about 15 I, I started drinking. You know? And and how was your upbringing as a kid? Uh, it, was, it was it was pretty good, you know what I mean? I had a, I had a good parents, you know. My dad was, uh, he was kind of fucked up. He drank a lot. He was a military guy. You know, he was in Korea, Vietnam. And, uh, okay. Uh, my mom was really, you know, really, uh, she was really, you know, a really sweet person. You know? She uh, she was a uh, uh, Sicilian. She came right over here from Sicily. Oh, okay. You know, so, uh, uh, yeah, she was, you know, she was like the, the rock, you know what I mean, of the family. You yeah. Know? She just died back in uh, on Halloween. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah. Okay. I, I missed the shit out of her, you know. Yeah, I bet you do, yeah. <clears throat> and now my brother just died uh, about a week and a half ago. Oh, sorry you know, about so that. So it's been, it's been kind of a rough year, you know. Oh, okay. Had you... Had you had many uh, brushes with the law at all? Yeah, I, well, I, I, did. I got almost 20 years in prison. And what was that for? Uh, drugs. Well, the, the main one was I did uh, like 14 years on a drug case, cocaine case. Cocaine case. Yeah. And where did you get nailed with that? Uh, at my at my house. They they raided my house. You know, and, you know, I just got you know I, I was married at the time. You know, I mean, it's two two babies and shit at the time. You know. You know, it was a bad situation. Okay. You know? And you got that kind of time out of it, huh? Yeah. At, at back then, they had that mandatory sentencing. You know, I got a, it was a mandatory 10 to 20 for what I They called me the 10 ounces of cocaine. You know, so, okay. You know. And how did the kids turn out? Good. Uh, they're in Florida right now. You know, they're, they're, you know, they're, I thank God for that. You know, they still love me and they talk to me. I, you know, I just talked to her the other day. My one daughter's a real estate agent in Tampa. She's doing real good. Good, you know? great. She wants me to come out there with her and shoot, you know. So, yeah, everything, everything's good with them. Thank God, you know. Yeah. They had every reason in the world to hate me, but they don't. Good. Know? Yeah, beautiful. So, uh, do you work now at all? Oh, I'm on disability You're now. on disability. Okay, yeah. good. And what would you say you spend a day on your drug do I have it? What would I spend? Yeah. Uh, probably... About 60 bucks a day. 60 bucks a day, huh? 60 bucks. Gotcha. Have you tried rehab before? Yeah, I just got out of rehab the other day. I went, uh, I, but I did, I just uh, went to detox, you know. Yeah. I'm, I'm getting off it, though. I am going back back to rehab, and, uh, and uh, I'm going to get off of this, you know what I mean? Yeah. Because I've had it, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I, I spend a lot of money on this, you know what I mean? And, you know. Like, like I said, it's about 60 bucks a day, but there's some days I might spend 200 yeah. you know what I'm saying? And, yeah, yep. You know, so you know, that's just for the heroin, the cocaine, something else, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, but, your... but I'm trying, you know, I'm, I'm working on getting off of this shit, you know. Okay, good. Good. And what's your favorite childhood memory? Uh, I don't know. I guess, you know, maybe... Uh, uh, on a Christmas morning over there with my mom and all my brothers and everything, you know what I mean? Okay. Back in time for good, you know what I mean? When we were kids, yeah. you know? Yeah, uh, yeah probably, probably then, you know. Favorite movie? Uh, the Godfather. Favorite book? Uh, damn, I've read so many of them. 
Okay. Uh, I don't know what my favorite book is, okay. to tell you the truth, but I mean, I've read so many, you know, when I was in prison and stuff. But, okay. You, know. Wait, you got any questions for me? Uh, no, I mean, uh, yeah, how long have you been doing this? I've been here? doing this probably five years, but oh, I've been doing it? this, you know, photos and stuff like that a long time before that. Yeah. yeah. So uh, how, uh, how's everything work on this? You, you, what do you, uh, you, I, it's like if I want to uh, see what's going on, yeah, I go on YouTube. Yep, you'll check, check back, he'll show you how to do it. Yep, okay. sure will. Yep. All right. Well, I appreciate the interview. Yeah, no problem, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Yep.